there and welcome to the first episode of my Planet Zoo videos. And as you can see, this is not a completely new map. Reason being, I spontaneously decided I wanted to upload the process to YouTube midway through building this entrance complex. So this was a very spontaneous decision. There was not much planning before uploading this. So I am sorry if the audio quality isn't the best compared to maybe other Planet Zoo YouTubers because as I said, I just spontaneously decided mid-playing that I'm going to record episodes for YouTube, so I'm doing all of this with very basic equipment, so apologies in advance for that, but however, it's still very much in the beginning stages, so I'm just going to start recording from here. And what you have been seeing on screen while I'm talking was basically me deciding what I wanted to do for the roof for this building. And what is also going to be in the first episode is a bit of the detailing for what I call the cake and the coffee corners. The cake corner being this blue, white and pinkish one. And then the coffee corner, obviously the other one that is very like dark themed and like elegant if you will i don't know how to describe it but i guess you know what i mean and i've already recorded a few episodes at this point granted this is just a fun side project for me so i'm not currently committing to a schedule or anything else i can however talk a bit about my plans for this franchise zoo as i have already played a bit and recorded a bit so the next episode is going to be the building or detailing, however you want to call it, of the restaurant that is in the other corner. And the third episode will then be the education counter, which will also be the last part to finishing what I currently call the food court. And it's basically this big entrance building and this is just right after you enter the zoo. So this is just really the very beginning of this franchise zoo. And then the fourth episode will be the interior of the reptile house, which is right next to this food court. Like one of the side entrances leads into that. I don't really know if you can even see it in the video because of how sped up it is. But anyway, I'm already talking about that because that's probably more exciting news than watching me build something that doesn't involve any animals at all in a zoo game. However, what I also will be revealing now is that I am planning to upload a lot of the stuff to the workshop. For example, the food corners that you are seeing me build right now will be uploaded to the workshop basically by the time this episode comes out. And I will also have a link to it in the description box down below. And since I also used like small props to like fill some of my shop corners, like for example, I used cake props and coffee mugs and stuff those were already existing workshop items so i will have the links to those in the description below as well and one of the bigger projects that i'm also planning to upload to the workshop are education signs and i will put an example on screen right now since again by the time I upload this, I will have already recorded new stuff and I will already have started the signs because I will need them for the reptile episode. And I noticed that when looking for educational signs, like the ones that you can use with like TV screens, not the ones that are like built with small pieces in game, there is not much 
when it comes to exhibit animals, which I'm guessing maybe has to do with their popularity compared to habitat animals. But also, I just wanted to create a big set of animal education signs that all kind of follow the same style. But I will be talking more about those in the actual reptile episode, because otherwise I will not have much to talk about in that one. And since I'm drawing those myself, I won't have every single animal done right away. I will just chip away at drawing them as I go along in the zoo. And then I will just gradually upload them to the workshop. So I'm currently trying to finish all the reptile and amphibian signs so that by the time I upload the reptile episode, I have most reptiles and amphibians covered. And then I will continue with like invertebrates, like all the spiders and like the um, leaf insect, for example. And then when I start on the habitat animals, I will just gradually upload them as I build their habitats, basically. But that is also just it for this episode. There's not much that I want to say for the rest of this episode. So I still hope you enjoyed the speed build, even though it was very unrelated to animals. But I hope you still had fun watching this and I hope to maybe see you in the next episode. Bye!